I love her so much. So I'm packing for the airport. I leave for the airport in an hour because I'm headed to the last part of my haul. If you guys don't know what I'm talking about, the grand finale for my what I got myself for Christmas haul is at the end of this vlog. But until then, I'm gonna show you guys some of the goodies that I got. I'm incorporating some of the things that I got myself for travel and just for this trip in general. I'm going to LA this week because one, I got invited to a lot of cool holiday events and parties and two, I have a place slash crash pad in LA now. So yeah, you guys are gonna see that at the end of this video. But for now, I'm gonna show you guys the packages that came in the mail before I head to the airport and finish packing. I wanna show you guys what I got. You guys know how I feel about my bed. It's super comfy. So whenever I travel, it's already hard as is to leave my pink cottage palace. But now that I have a comfy bed, it's even harder to part ways with this bed. So as you guys can see, this is the big pile of things I got myself. I'm currently wearing the Skims um, top that goes with my Skims order. I'm going to just show you guys this overview because... I don't know how I'm going to sit in frame with everything. So if you guys follow me on TikTok, I showed you guys that I got PR from Stony Clover Juicy Collab. This is the beautiful bag it came in. I left it as is because it just looks super cute in here. But this is my makeup bag and I'm bringing this with me to LA. I also got the For Nice Girls Who Like Stuff cosmetic bag. So adorable. This cosmetic bag says glam and it's green. And then I got a green skin bag right here. I got myself the Ariana Grande Fragrances Mod Vanilla and Mod Blush. The boxes are beautiful. You get a nice detailed review about these fragrances on this channel if you guys wanna check those out. I wanted to wait for this video, but I was too excited. I got myself another designer bag at Designer Consigner in Bethlehem. I have been eyeing this bag out for quite some time. It's Gucci, and when I think of holiday, I think of pink, I think of sugar plum and beautiful, I think of beautiful mess. Just popping in here and interrupting this try on haul to let you guys know that beautiful mess is available this holiday season. It's my custom perfume that smells like the land of sweets. If you want to smell like a pistachio macaroon and sugar, then this is the fragrance for you. Every coquette needs this silhouette perfume bottle on their vanity. It looks so beautiful. You get so many sprays in one bottle. It's $50. I'm linking it down below. I had to get this girl, this Gucci bag. I've been eyeing out for so long. She is so beautiful. Literally looks like a Christmas ornament. She's like a little rose gold and rosy. Oh, I forgot to show the jewelry pouch from Stony Clover, so cute. But yeah, I got this girl, I love her so much. You guys are gonna see her in LA. Then I got the matching bottom skims with this top, but I don't know how I feel about these. I feel like because I'm so small, it looks like I'm drowning in fuzz. So I might return these. I've never said that in a what I got myself for Christmas vlog before. I got this blush zip up hoodie that is just so comfy. I got these fuzzy socks. From Skims. I got a basic tee and I got a black version of the sweatshirt that I've been wearing all year from Skims. It's just so comfortable. Actually, no, this is cropped. The one that I wear, the cream one, is longer. This is like a cropped fleece. I feel like a lot of these outfits are like travel outfits and I'm really excited about them. So the other items that are in here I can't show. They're Christmas presents for my friends and family, but I got a free people order. I got this beautiful choker. Someone told me chokers are coming back and I didn't believe them until I saw this was a new arrival on Free People. 
literally rose gold stars, a mauve pink choker, just so cute. And I got these socks to wear with heels. And the model was wearing these socks with heels and I was like, I need these. They're gold and sparkly and they look so comfy. So I got these two things from Free People. I got the strawberry Rococo makeup. Look how beautiful the packaging is. I got this in the mail. This is PR. I want to do like a whole unboxing of all this because I feel like you guys would really, really, really enjoy this makeup as I will. And I feel like Obviously, I'm running late for the airport, but I feel like this deserves its moment. Like, look how beautiful the packaging is. If I had my own makeup line, this is what the packaging would look like. It's just so gorgeous and couture. I love this all. One of my all-time favorite gifts to give people is the Radiant Spin Care System by Duval. For those of you who've been watching my videos know that I've been using this for years now. They've always been really, really great presents. You get two cleansing heads, a pumice, a body brush, all for the price of one. And I have an ongoing code that I've had for years down below that could get you guys 75% off of this for gifts for people. This is my favorite thing to use if I wanna exfoliate my skin and do nice skin prep before a makeup look or a face beat or an event. So I'm actually packing my own to LA as as we speak so I was reminded to show you guys this. I'm gonna finish packing. I know that was like a quick haul. Oh my god it seemed like it would be a lot longer but I guess it's not. But I'm gonna finish packing and then we're gonna travel to LA. Good morning, fancy babies. It's my first morning in the LA home. I don't know how much I wanna show you in this vlog because I have all these ideas. As soon as I got here, I was like thinking about Pinterest and I'm gonna insert some photos here of like what I was picturing that I wanna do. I'm like thinking this is gonna be like a cottage in the hills. So I wanna call this place like the Hills Cottage. Right now, everything is just literally white and neutral and plain, but the bones are here. So this is balcony one. This came like semi-furnished, but I'm gonna just like change things out. I have like this shelf right here that's holding my bags. Um, I'm just gonna say this in this vlog because anytime I post that I get like another home or I'm staying somewhere else, everyone's always like, oh, what about your Pennsylvania home? Um, the Cottage Palace is not going anywhere. So um, I still have her in Pennsylvania. This is just a second home, a place that I can come to and call home when I come to LA. I made the decision that like in the new year during the colder months, I'm gonna primarily be here after the holidays. I don't know about you guys, but like when it's not Christmas and it's just like cold, those of you who are on the East Coast, like it's just not fun to just be stuck in the cold till like April or May or personally, that's just how I feel. I mean, you might feel different, but um, I think it's like fun like around Valentine's Day, but you know, I feel like after Christmas, I'm like, I want spring. So that's one of like the big reasons why I like wanted like another place in general. But secondly, um, I'm gonna be working on more new music with like different people and different producers. And I'm kind of like rebuilding a different team in a way. And in order to do that and to take up a ton of meetings, emerge myself more into work, I gotta be here. I love Pennsylvania and I feel like Pennsylvania like has my heart and I'm always gonna go back to like Pennsylvania. I feel like at least every three weeks I'm gonna need my Pennsylvania fix, but like I wanna primarily be here next year because when I'm in Pennsylvania, I love being there and it's, a, it's like a nice place to escape to, but I find that the only work that I do is like on YouTube and it's not in-person stuff and it's not events and I feel like you're only in your 20s once, you're only young once and you know, nothing's promised and I never really did this. Like I always had anxiety. I was in like my own apartment in Westwood in 2018 for like maybe a year and then the pandemic happened and obviously because of the pandemic so I had to move out and then before that I was like kind of in LA with Nikki in Santa Monica but that like didn't last long either. The reason the first apartment didn't last too long was because 
I was in a new relationship with someone that was in Pennsylvania and I always wanted to go home to Pennsylvania but now that I'm just like a busy working girl in her Carrie Bradshaw era I'm like trying to eat this up I love being couture today I have this brand deal this in-person brand deal that I'm filming that I'm not gonna show you in a vlog till January in person like see what I mean getting a brand deal in person um, and then later tonight I have a Nana Jacqueline holiday dinner event and they're dressing me in this really really pretty pink outfit and I'm gonna vlog that for you guys um, but yeah I'm gonna start my day and get my makeup on so this is the dress that Nana Jacqueline selected for me to wear to the holiday party it's just so gorgeous I posted some photos on my Instagram if you guys want to check it out but look how beautiful this setup is. It was in a private room at Crustacean in Beverly Hills. And I was super flattered. I was literally sitting on the end of the table. And I just felt like a queen. So thank you so much, Nana Jacqueline, for having me. This was such a beautiful, intimate event. And it definitely helped me feel the holiday spirit while being in a warmer climate. <laughs> So the next day, I had a shoe. I was being styled and fitted by Nana Jacqueline. Shopping for the shoe today. Look how beautiful their store is. It was the most beautiful shade of pink ever. And surprise, surprise, I got bangs. So how this happened was Val was doing my hair and we were like, you know what? I have a chemical cut already. Let's just go ahead and do bangs. And it turned out to be a very, very cute look for this photo shoot. And in general, every day, day to day, the long blonde hair with bangs, I feel like it's a vibe. It's like a good new era look, especially for the new year.